Hey guys, it's Josh from Apt here with the Asus MX299Q cinematic display. It's a very wide screen. It's just like taking two 17-inch monitors right next to each other. However, it's not like having 1920 by 1080 twice. You're talking about 2560 by 1080. It's a high resolution screen. And what that's going to do for you is if you're a video editor, a gamer, you already know this, but for those that don't, you're going to see more of your timelines in one shot as opposed to scrolling left and right. Even if you have a 32 inch that's running 1080p, having a higher resolution is still going to show you kind of more content. It may not be as big as that TV or monitor, but the high resolution is key for those video editors or gamers. Gamers especially, if you're running through different fields, you're a first person shooter, or if you're doing any kind of flight simulation, you actually are going to see more of the content. So having that high resolution makes this monitor pretty special. It's not just a wide monitor. It's also a high quality display. It's IPS, which means that the angles that we're viewing, like if I have a client and I'm showing them the video we're working on together, things like that, the angles you're looking at look really sharp and the color distortion is minimal. So it's a high quality resolution. It's a great display as far as you know the angles you could view. Connectivity wise, you've got HDMI, which will carry audio. There are built in Bang & Olufsen speakers. Uh, if you don't use HDMI, you could use the um, DVI connection. And if you are a Mac user, don't worry, it's compatible. But you're going to convert Mini DisplayPort or Thunderbolt. Well, you'll use your Thunderbolt connection, which is the Mini DisplayPort size. And then you'll need a female full-size DisplayPort adapter to run a full-size DisplayPort cable. And then you will achieve this full resolution. Uh, but outside of that, it's really one of the coolest monitors we've seen because there really isn't anything like it having that wide screen. You can see a full selection of monitors by visiting apt.com, and while you're there, uh, like, comment, or subscribe to our YouTube channel.